Hi guys, so today I will learn how to create this dynamic view. You can replace the red and the blue view with any view you want. It's fully dynamic. Uh, I hope you like it and have a nice day. I have added all the state that we need and here's some comments to help you understand and let you know about this state. For example, we have here minimal value. I want the drug gesture stop when we reach 150. And here for the speed, when you're dragging, how fast you want. And here's some comments or task we do, like when we're creating the drag gesture, when I tap the line of code, you understand what we're doing and why we need it. And here, very simple view, rectangle, have a color, and with infinity. Let's start adding the views, like I need red one, on the VStack, one more will be blue and give it frame, height, bottom view. For this one, it will be top view. I need to know the size of the screen, so I need geometry reader. Geometry. Geo in, insert geometry, delete the padding, on appear. So now we have the bottom and the height is zero. But I want to start with half the screen. I say total variable space equal geo dot size dot height and top view equal total divide by two the same for the bottom total divide by two and we ignore the save area we make we have a spacing so let's make it zero spacing zero on the finishing app, you have this view between red and blue view. We can drag from anywhere. So this one is simple right angle with a Z stack and another one right angle. Say Z stack right angle. We get frame max with infinity and another right angle. Then frame will be sixty six and for this one give it frame height will be thirty and for ground color black. Let's add the gesture to the Z stack. Gesture, drag gesture. We say on change. Value N. We start with this one. Let's add the gesture, will we able to drag to the top or the bottom? Select speed or drag amount equal value dot transition dot height. We'll drag, we'll be able to drag to the top or the bottom. If you want left or right, we do with. And we take this a dragging value and we add it to the height to the top view let top or red view equal max minimal value when we want to make sure is always will stop on 150 
top view plus speed or dragging if we drag it to the bottom like 50 we'll add the value to the red view and we do the same for the bottom view bottom view so now we assign the value to the new total height we say if a new total height less or equal total variable height we say top view equal a new red view bottom view equal a new blue view okay else I'll copy paste with the comments if speed greater than zero will be top view equal max minimal value total variable view minus bottom view and for the bottom equal max we do the same minimal height total minus top view so this one if we are talking to the bottom if we are talking to the top or just go based for the comments we do the next we say bottom height inside max I'll always make sure we have minimal value like 150 total variable space that minus top view and the top view side max minimal value total variable space minus bottom view so if, if we drag into the top oh wait a second here should be minus drag to the top bottom And here for the speed, if you want like faster, I think a three or four is good. But and here this drag gesture is not working well. If you just run the app, this was black because it was on dark mode. So we drag to the bottom, top. Speed is good, works just fine. And you can't you can't add any view you want over here. 